Hi everybody, welcome back. We're here this week looking at another ship. We're looking at Love Thud's Ballistic Brother, the uh, Starfighter Inferno. It's over here. It looks just like the Starfighter from the, from the back anyway, but from the rest of it, it's a little bit darker. Yeah. Yeah, he's got, he's a little broody. Yeah, compared to his brother, he's, he's a little sad. See, his brother is all bright and shiny and happy and he's a, he's a, just a broody Batman. Ugh, criminals. But yes, the Ares Starfighter Inferno. It looks just like his brother, as I just said. You can even climb on its wing like his brother, too. <laughs> you can climb all over the ship easily. <laughs> Although, don't try to get into the cockpit from up here. That, that'll just be stupid. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why can't I get back up? Ah. Because if you try to get it... Yeah, it just lets you open the pilot canopy. <laughs> Although, if you come over here, things become a little bit different. That one. I want to see what happens. <laughs> okay. Well, before we do that... <laughs> just like the uh, Ion, it's got these big old tubes. Got some tubes over here. Bunch of missiles it fires out. Those are size threes, if I remember correctly. And I believe they are pretty much locked to the ship at that size. I don't think you're changing that rack out. I mean, maybe there's other racks, but I doubt that rack's getting changed. Anyhow, let's go ahead and... What is that? It's open on that side, too. We need to go and look at something, everyone. Why is my ship open? Whoa, wait a minute, what's that? That's that's even cooler. Whoa! Oh, so this is where one of the ship components is. The shield generator is up here. Ha <laughs> ha! I was gonna look at that, and then I was distracted by the actual shield generator. Neat. So that means... Not that. Well, okay, that one doesn't open. But that one opens. What do we have? We have... Computer and... Quantum drive. What are you? Oh, you're a cooler. I said it right on top. Never mind. You're stupid. Man, you get rid of the big giant capacitor and all you got left is a little small revolver chamber. <laughs> Anyhow. Let's go ahead and do a couple things like not wear armor that we, we could lose and go check out the Urkel. Alright, here we are looking at the Urkel. We've got, on our weapons, we got a, a SF-7B locked to the uh, ship. It's that big, huge Gatling cannon on the on the uh, right side of the ca uh, cockpit there. Comes with 3,800 rounds in it, which is pretty decent amount of ammo compared to what of whatever else we've ever seen. It's still really kind of almost just enough to take out a hammerhead. <laughs> Comes with a crossfield size 2 quantum drive in it, which means you don't really need to change that. I mean, you can if you want. There's really only one other thing that you could use that's different. I am not even going to say it's better. It's just different. You use a little more fuel, but slightly faster. The crossfield's not very slow either, so... For the missile racks, we have uh, two size five racks holding a total of eight infrared vipers, threes, and then a size seven Ares rack that holds the size three arresters, 12 of them. And those are the ones that fire out one at a time. The little the kunk, kunk, the kunk, the kunk. <laughs> and on the shields, we got two full stop size two military grade C shields doing 9,000 hit points per for you. So you get 9,000 on front, 9,000 on rear. A couple of size two Maelstrom military grade Cs, giving us about <laughs> a stupid amount of power at uh, not really needing much of that at all because we only have a ballistic Gatling gun, not a, not a laser. And it's got three size two Arctic coolers, but who cares? Because they don't really do much of anything anyway, especially, well, this ship might actually end up getting kind of warm eventually. Is a heavy fighter, a combat ship, size 3 of 
crew size of you, 10,000 hit points to the body, 200 hit points to the nose, and I believe it. Uh, I have had a couple of situations in a Crusader Starfighter where I was just getting lit up in the in the face and died very quickly. So that is the weak point of the ship, is its face. The little tiny little cockpit. If that thing starts taking too much damage, you're gonna be done really fast. <laughs> uh, but it does have a total of 30,100 hit points all around, so, you know, the wings, the body, the nose, all together. We got 450,000 something capacity of hydrogen and 5,000 capacity something of quantum fuel. Plenty of fuel to get you around everywhere in the whole entire system. And for a nice price of 2.8 million AUEC, yeah, I accidentally, I, I misread my own handwriting for some stupid reason, I thought it was 3.8 million AUC. Uh, massive shout out to Shabloink and Mr. B for helping me out and finishing with the funds for this ship because I was lacking. Uh, but anyhow, the, the, that other million, that'll go towards my next ship. Maybe I'll get a raft and try mining again. Yeah, we all know how that goes for me. Come on, draw back. Uh oh. <laughs> uh. Okay. Did this cycle the power? Maybe. Okay, I think I broke the ship. But anyhow, that's the Starfighter. Uh, it is also available sometimes. Well, it was available in store when it first came out, but I don't think I've seen it go back on sale since. So, yeah, for now, this is how you get it. <laughs> it's the Crusader showroom. All right, back to the show. All right, let's go ahead and hop back in here. Welcome back, everyone, from the Ergul. We're gonna hop in and grab up a mission. Nice special mission. Hopefully we don't die because it's uh it's not gonna be easy. <laughs> and as you always do, collect call arms. Even though I'm really not thinking I'm gonna take out all three of these guys or whatever, however many there are. Because as soon as I find it, there it is. We're going after a hammerhead. Yay, it's been a while since we had the ability to just go after hammerheads whenever we want. Bum bum. Nope, stop. Stop wiggling. Stop it. Yep. Nope. Nope. Mm-mm. Okay. Straight. Thank you. Landing gear up. All that raw power. Rawr! Crusader and its lovely, lovely engines. Leaving Crusader. See? There's Crusader back there. And over there. And over there. And over there. And over there. But, not that way. Do yellow. All right, we got 3,800 rounds in this bad boy. That should be enough to take out the hammerhead. Hopefully. And since we're all ballistic, we can go full shields. Let's see, Valkyrie. There's the main boy. All right, so what would be the best way to do this? I suppose I could just try to dump missiles at the ads until the real fight starts. See how this works. Oh, 
finally got a hit. And another hit. He looks like he can't take much more punishment like this. Are you kidding me? It was green for half a second. Come on. Oh, well. Okay, well, he stopped moving, I guess. Maybe he's just dead in the water. At, at least took care of one guy, sort of, ish. Let's go ahead and hammer the hammerhead. Man, that is like some fireworks. <laughs> I just hope I can survive it long enough. Okay, shields, come back now. Any day now. At least I'm faster than him. <laughs> By a lot. I like how I tried to put my shields up to full power again, like, oh, come back shields, they were already there. Let's weaken them down a little bit. Whenever it, you know, targets him. There we go. We're gonna wait till we're a little closer still. Closer. Closer. Wow, I'm like half dead. <laughs> These hammerheads are no joke. And that guy's still right on my tail trying to get me. The other guy behind me. Alright, that's close enough. I know you can't take too much of this punishment. It would be nice if there was somebody around to help me drop your shields though, so you could take the full punishment of these ballistics. I don't like when I'm actually firing at his side profile because his side profile is really skinny. Let's try to get a little bit closer to this side. Ah, well. Oh well. <laughs> I mean, the thing hits hard, and it was accurate enough at la that range, but at that range, I was also getting lit up. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and come back for more. Later.